Hey, everybody. We are live at Paste in Austin, Texas right now during South by 2019 with Taylor Jansen. Taylor, thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. Yeah. Thank you for uh, coming all the way down from Winnipeg, Manitoba. That is amazing. Yeah, it's, it's far, yeah. but it's uh, warmer here. I like it. <laughs> yeah, it is, man. And finally, the rain broke. We've got a beautiful day. Birds are out. Dogs are barking. It's sunny. Everything's great. Yeah. Uh, thanks for doing this. So you're going to do three songs today. You're doing one off of, uh, of Shouting Matches, the forthcoming EP. It'll be out in May. So yeah. pre-congratulations on that. Thank you. Um, and two off the previous EP. Uh, can you tell us what's coming up first? Uh, so first is uh, the title track off of my next project called Shouting Matches. Uh, yeah, I'm excited about it. All right. <laughs> And I look out and I can't make out anything So I burn all my bridges down just to have something to see But you don't need to worry, darling, I don't need to escape From this ever-growing shyness that I can't help but create for myself good for me I'd open up the blinds I'd let the sun fill my room and I'd let it change my life but you don't need to worry darling one day I'll be just fine I'll stare up into the shore until it burns right through my eyes so is that what you want is that what you wanted from me is that what you want? Is that what you needed to see? Oh, if I see the beauty in everything, then how am I to know just what to see when it all burns down? And there's no Starting shouting matches with God But you should start to worry, darling If you can't hear the signs Calling out through my broken promise Didn't you ask me to be honest? Oh, isn't that what you want? Is that what you wanted from me? Is that what you Thank you, Taylor. That sounded great. Thank you so much. 
Um, so this is what we'll talk about next. It's not a segue from a song or a segue to a song, but we would be remiss if we did not mention Anna was saying that you have an undying love for the actor Dennis Quaid, and I would like to hear uh, what it is that brought that about and what what is it between with, uh, with uh, you and Dennis Quaid. Why Dennis Quaid? Man, so it kind of started a little bit as a joke because I love that video of him on Ellen when he, he's like, Dennis Quaid is here. Dennis Quaid wants a coffee, you know? <laughs> so, like, whenever I wanted coffee, I'd be like, Dennis Quaid wants a coffee. But also, I, I loved The Parent Trap growing up. So it was like, I love him for both reasons. And then eventually, like, the joke turned very real for me. <laughs> and I just want to be his friend. <laughs> uh, I don't know. It's, it, I have a song named after him. Not about him, but named after him. And it's going to be on the next EP as well. But, and yeah. a T-shirt of him that you did not buy that you made? I, my uh, cousin got it made for me for Christmas because she's like, man, I want to get Taylor like a T-shirt with Dennis Quaid on it. But like that doesn't exist. <laughs> <laughs> so she had to get it made. And uh, I should have brought it. I really should have. <laughs> well, hopefully we can use this platform for some good. Hopefully this makes its way to Dennis Quaid and something happens with you guys in the future. Maybe you get a Maybe. Dennis Quaid t-shirt from Dennis Quaid for next Christmas. Don't even. <laughs> That's no. <laughs> That'd be too much for me. Um, well, the first shouting matches sounded great. Can you tell us what you're going to do second? Uh, so next I'm going to play uh, one of my songs off of the last EP that I did called Interpersonal. Uh, and this song is called The Waiting Room.
Thank you. All right, thank you. Um, and this next question is also apropos of absolutely nothing, but this is so much more fun than regular press. Anna okay. also shared uh, that, uh, so I, we know about Rory Gilmore, and I want, can you talk to us about Rory Gilmore and Rory Gilmore, a special place in your life? Okay, so <laughs> I have this cat, and I personally believe, and I know that normally when people talk about their cats, like no one cares about your cat, but like I think everyone should care about my cat. Because she is um, a model, I think. I think she's the Tyra Banks of cats, in my personal, professional opinion, um, of what Tyra Banks of cats would look like. Um, she's gorgeous. She has her own Instagram. Um, <laughs> and her name is Rory Gilmore, because I love Rory Gilmore. <laughs> um, but she, uh, the first time I saw her, I was like, yep. Yeah. yeah, I love you. <laughs> Love at first sight. She's well, gorgeous. Thank you so much for sharing about about Dennis, about Rory, thank and you for asking uh, thank about you for sharing her. these songs with us too. Uh, can you tell us what you're going to play third? All right. Uh, the song's called Stations. It's off of my last EP, um, also from in Interpersonal. So, yeah. <laughs>
right. That was great. Thank you so much for coming and doing it. Thank and you for having me. Yeah, yeah, of course. And best of luck on Shouting Matches that comes out. Uh, the EP comes out in May. And uh, you've got a handful of tour dates announced, including Shaky Knees. That one's going to be a ton of fun. Yeah. And um, all of the that. information's up at uh, uh, sadsongsforeveryone.com. <laughs> Yeah, uh, which is awesome. <laughs> so good for you for doing that. And uh, thanks again for coming by. Thank you so much for having me. All right.